him. Raise your hands unto him in the name of Jesus. We serve a mighty God. We serve a faithful God. You are worthy, Jesus. You are worthy, Jesus. The word of God says in Ecclesiastes 12.1 that remember you are greater in the days of your youth. I pray that you may remember you are greater in your days of your youth. We have strength. We have everything it takes to worship our God and to serve him in truth and in spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Just worship him. Just raise your hands and your voice unto him. He is the king of kings. He is the Lord, our redeemer. He is our creator, our healer. In the name of Jesus, we bless your holy name, O God. Oh, glory to you, Jesus. Glory to you, Jesus. Consume our sacrifice tonight, O God. We raise our voice to you, O God. We lift up our holy name, O God. We say, Lord, that there is none like you, Jesus. We know you are able and we are with you, Jehovah. Mahana kuna mugine kama we with Jehovah. Oh, zakata la ba 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 ba. Just worship Him. Just surrender everything unto Him. Let the Spirit of God zeketele ba 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 ba. Pray in your spirit. Zukata la ba 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 ba. Oh, our God is faithful. There is nothing that He cannot do. Zeketele ba 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 ba. Oh, we thank you, Jesus. Bwana wetu anaweza kuna jambo asiloniweza Mwinulie mikono yako Tunapomwambia anaweza Bwana wetu anaweza kuinua anaweza kuponya anaweza Hakuna jambo asiloniweza Oh Jesus Oh Oh Jesus Unaweza Bwana Oh unaweza Yesu
Kwa familia zetu wametenda maajabu Mwinulia sauti yako na umaburi zoni ya leo Inua sauti yako zele poko tole baba baba Yesu umetelea maajabu zoni ya leo Seke tele baba 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 Ro poko tele baba baba Asante Yesu Asante Yesu Seke tele baba baba Oh zika tele baba baba Zule baba baba Inua sauti yako mema le pozi Zeketeleba na ijuli kane dunia ni kote na ijuli kane oh zeleba na ijuli kane ijuli kane we ni mugu we ni mugu oh ijuli kane usikuwa leo ni we ni mugu na ijuli kane we we Was 
Tenda mambo maku Oh, ijulikane we duniani kote Na ijulikane duniani kote Wimbia kutoka juu, na ijulikane we ni mungu Na ijulikane we we ni mungu Oh, sheke tele baba 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 Mungu wetu anaweza kumonga Seketele baba 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 tunabuni mungu wakwela Seketele baba Naejibu maumbi yetu Naejulikane Seketele baba Vizazi vyote zinachukua Seketele baba baba Naejulikane Dunia nikote Vizazi Hadi Ya kufamu wewe Ulie mungu wakali Na ulie mungu wale Kazi za kuza onesha Uku wako wewe Umezukuka
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Nataka tuende kumwimbia Mungu sifa. Haleluya. Salimia jirani yako muulize kama ako tayari. Zeketele baba. Zuketele baba. Pigia Yesu makofu. Pigia Yesu makofu. Zeketele. Weka mikono juu, weka mikono. Haya wapi shambo na vigelegele kwa Yesu. Na sama piga piga shangwe na viga legele Wabi viga legele kwa buwana yesu wata Siyone wato kifuraia buwana chambeni Sipa na utukufu 
So we must praise him. Praise him in an African way. So we must praise him. Praise him in an African way. Big your bona yesuma kopi mazuri. Hallelujah. Ma kopi yesuma zuri ni azuki la moja. Piga piga. Piga piga piga. Amen, 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 amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Our Lord is worthy to be exalted, to be glory given all the God. praise and all the glory and all the honor. I want us to just lift our hands in a minute and then we tell him you are worthy to be exalted. All the praises that we have given in this place belong to you. Can you just take a moment and then you tell him I thank you because you are worthy to be praised, to be glorified. Tell him you are worthy. All the praises come to you. Let them sound like a sweet aroma to the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords, the one that seated above. Come on, somebody open your mouth and bless him from the deepest part of your spirit. Bless him from your spirit in the name of Jesus. Tell him every worship is due you. Every praise is due you. Every adoration. Tell him even the strength of my young age belongs to you. Come on, somebody bless him, bless him, bless him. In the precious name of the Lord, Baga Soprado Shakadalababa. We bless you, we thank you, and we glorify you. Thank you because you are here with us to bless us, to exalt us even to shift our lives to the glory and honor of your mighty name. We thank you. We glorify you. Thank you because you are worthy in our lives. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Let's give the Lord a beautiful heart of praise. Amen. 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 Without taking much time, it's not my pleasure to welcome our man of God even to bring the word. Let's appreciate our man of God as he comes. Amen. 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 Let's appreciate Jesus. Let's appreciate Jesus. Hallelujah. I want to ask us to draw closer, if you can come closer. If you can come closer to that empty space in front of you, it will be a joy. It will be such a joy to have you close by. To have you close by. If you can pull close, if you can pull close, take the privilege and Come closer. Take the privilege and come closer. Allow me to ask the worship team to bless us with one song. We may have our seats. Let's have our seats as they bless us with one song. Amen. 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 Sibyo, nafsi inataka tushushu imani yetu, lakini tuwe na imani kwa manenda kutenda. Apasi ata kama tuwezi kuona kwa macho yetu, lakini tuamini kwa mba anatenda. Sibyo, mpigi makofi wana isu.
Let's put our hands once again together and appreciate Jesus. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, worship team. Let's appreciate the worship team. Let's appreciate the worship team. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Shall we stand as we read the word of the Lord tonight? Welcome, you that is watching us, we want to say welcome to our service tonight. You are going to be blessed for tuning in. Your tuning in is not in vain. Heavenly Father, shall we pray? Heavenly Father, we are so grateful for this precious moment that Lord you give to us to hear your word. I pray that as I bring forth your word to your people tonight, you will impact us with your grace and with your power. And our lives will never be the same again. Let there be deliverance, salvation, revelation, impartation tonight. We give you glory and we give you praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Shall we turn our Bibles together to the first epistle of the Apostle Paul? to his spiritual son called Timothy. In chapter 6 of the first epistle of Timothy, verse 11 to 16. The Bible says, can we read the word of the Lord? Uh, first Timothy chapter 6 verse 11. The Bible says, Shall we read from the screens? But you, O man of God, flee these things and pursue righteousness. Can we repeat again? But you, O man of God, flee these things and pursue righteousness, godliness, faith, love, patience, and gentleness. Give it to us in Swahili. 
bali wewe mtu wa Mungu uyakimbie mambo hayo Mani, upendo subira upole fanya nini uyakimbie ayo mambo twende 12 mbili piga vita vile vizuri vya imani fanya nini piga vita vile vizuri vya imani shika uzima ule wa milele angalia jirani mwambie shika nini uzima ule wa milele ulio itiwa ukaungama maungamo mazuri mbele ya mashahidi wengi ukaungama maungamo mazuri mbele ya mashahidi wengi 13 i had you na kuagiza mbele za Mungu una unaye vifadhi hai vitu vyote na mbele za Kristo Yesu aliye yaungama maungamo mazuri yale mbele ya Pontio Pilato kwamba ulinde amri hii pasipo mawao pasipo la mama hata kufanuliwa kwake Bwana wetu Yesu Kristo tano ambako yeye kwa majira yake atakudhihirisha yeye alie imidiwa mwenye uweza peke yake mfalme wa wafalme bwana wa mabwana sita ambaye yeye peke yake apatikane na mauti amekaa katika nuru isiyoweza kukabribiwa wala hakuna mwanadamu aliyewahi kumwona wala awezae kumwona heshima na uweza una yeye hata milele amina tunaweza kaa na bwana alibariki neno lake rudi moja rudi pale moja bali wewe tuseme neno la Mungu bali wewe mtu wa Mungu uyakimbie mambo hayo nao ni vizuri tuelewe ni mambo magani hayo ambayo huyu kijana anaitwa Timotheo anaagizwa na baba yake wa kiroho ayakimbie ni mambo magani hayo twende pale katika mstari wa tap anasema nini wa tatu mstari wa tatu mtu awaye yote akitoa mafundisho mengine wala ayakubali maneno yenye uzima wa Bwana wetu Yesu Kristo wala mafundisho yapatanayo na utaua give it to us in english if anyone teaches otherwise and does not consent to all some words even the words of our lord jesus christ and to the doctrine which accords with godliness verse 4 he is proud listen to me let's read the word of god that person go back to verse 3 that person that does not consent to the awesome words even the words of our lord jesus christ to the doctrine which accords with godliness now there is a doctrine that accords 
with godliness. This sound is not good. There is a doctrine that accords with godliness. And that doctrine has all some words. And those all some words are the words of our Lord Jesus Christ. Now, whoever that does not consent to that, verse 4, verse 4, tell your neighbor, help me preach to your neighbor, tell your neighbor, whoever that does not consent to that, to those words and to that doctrine, he is proud. That person is what? Can we talk? Do I have young people in the house? Whoever that does not consent, can you help me preach? Say what I'm saying. You keep saying what I'm saying. You are preaching. Whoever that does not consent to the doctrine of Jesus Christ and the doctrine of his words, that person, that person, we are talking about that person. Ask your neighbor, do you know that person? Come on, talk to me. Do you know that person? Whoever that does not consent Give it to us in Swahili. Was semen it to me. Biblia, your Biblia, you can't say my mambo magumu. Ebu to pati katika study watat. Mtu ambaye yote akitoa mafundisho mengine. Wala ayakubali. Kwa hivyo, mtu yeyote asie kubali maneno ya uzima. Wabwana wetu Yesu Kristo. Mtu yoyote asie ambatana na mafundisho ya Yesu Kristo. Huyo mtu mstari wa nne kuwa mwepesi Huyo mtu ameja majivuno Wala afahamu neno lolote eh? Mbali anawazimu wa kuwazia Abari gani? Zamaswari Yeye upenda mapa. Yeye upenda mambo ya ku mashindano. Thank you. Mtu yeyote. Si unisaidia kubiria jirani yako. Ni mi nimekupa rusa. Mtu yeyote. Asie ambatana. Mtu yeyote. Mtu yeyote. Anaeza kuwa anapesa. Anaeza kuwa anapesa. Lakini kama ambatani na mafundisho Ya Yesu Kristo Huyo mtu ameja majivuno Mtu yoyote Anaeza kuwa na cheo Anaeza kuwa na nguvu Lakini kama ambatani Na mafundisho ya Yesu Kristo Huyo mtu amejam. Kwani unaogopa kutaja? Kwani ni wewe? Angalia jirani sema taja. Kwani ni wewe? Kama sio wewe sema kile tunasema. Asie ambatana na mafundisho ya Yesu Kristo. Huyo mtu ameja majivuno. Eh? Yaani maringo mafea. Fever. Mama nafikiria sijui hizo. Ameja majivuno. Na huyo mtu tumuongeze kitu kingine. Afana ufahamu. Anaweza kuwa anaongea kizungu. Anaweza kuwa alipata e shule lakini ana ufahamu. Yeah. Na yeye ame, anawazimu Bila Yesu Kristo Oh my God Sio pasta chengo ni neno la mungu Gonga jirani muambie Sio pasta chengo ni neno la mtu ya yote Asie na maneno ya Yesu Kristo Asie kupaliana na mafundisho ya Yesu Kristo Yeye ameja majivuno Ameja maringo Afahamu chochote Tena yeye anawazimu Anaeza kuwa mushana murembo 
anaweza kuwa kijana ako na kifua ya W Lakini kama ana Yesu Kristo na maneno ya Yesu Kristo nasema kama ana maneno ya Yesu Kristo amejaa wasim Kwa hivyo msituke watu wakitembea uchi ni wazim Mulikuwa mnangojea seven points ndio hizi moja ni wazimu bila Yesu <laughs> bila Yesu swangalie so jirani mwambie bila Yesu Kristo bila neno la Yesu Kristo Hallelujah I say somebody shout hallelujah put your hands together and celebrate Jesus I say celebrate Jesus. Huyo mtu, huyo mtu anaweza kuwa na pesa. Anaweza kuwa na cheo. Anaweza heshimiwa na wanadamu. Lakini kama ana neno la Yesu, yeye amejaa majivuno. Tena yeye ni wazimu. Anaweza kuwa amevaa vizuri lakini ni wazimu amevaa. Tuendelee hapo chini. Na tena kitu kingine ako nayo ni mashindano. 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 Kama kuna vitu vinasumbua vijana leo ni roho ya mashindano. Kiona mtu amenyoa nywele ameacha kamoja hapa peke yake unaenda unaacha kako hapa ni wazimu na mashindano unaona vitu kwa runinga bila kufikiria shida ya kutofikiria ni kwamba huyo mtu ana ufahamu shida ya hiki kizazi cha kuangalia mambo kwa runinga cha kukutana na mambo kwa mitaa na unahinga bila kufikiria ni kwamba kizazi hiki kimepoteza ufahamu ufahamu na ufahamu wa kweli ni kumjua Yesu Kristo Ufahamu wa kweli ni kuweka maneno ya Yesu Kristo katika moyo wako. Bila hiyo utajaa maringo. 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 Unapepetwa na kaswende na uko hapa. Maringo na mtu anakufa. anabomoa mapavu na anavuta sigara mtu ambaye hapa chini imeandikwa uvutaji wa sigara una madhara kwa afya yako na anavuta ni, u, ni bongolala ni kichwa iko empty Aliso, alipoteza school fees ya watoto ya wazazi. Hiyo school fees ingenunua kichaka isaidie. Lakini ana chochote, ana ufahamu hata ile ameandikiwa imustue. Hata siku hizi nasikia mmechorewa picha. Msipoelewa kwa maneno. Iki kizazi kina kazi, wacha nitoa. Court ni wahubirie. Ni wasaidie kama unataka kupona nyakati zenu ja Yesu Kristo mfahamu nataka ni kujua ni kufa moyo si yangu ya tamani ni nataka hiyo huo ndio wimbo unastahili kuwa wimbo wa kizazi chetu hiyo ndiyo inastahili kuwa shahuku like kizazi kutaka kujua Mungu sio kutaka kuolewa 
sio kutaka kazi hapana sio kutaka pesa aa hiyo vitu vingine ni mzuri maandiko yanasema tafuteni kwanza kwanza ufalme wa Mungu na hizi zingine zote mtaongezewa I said hallelujah. Na tushuke hapo chini. Ana mashindano ya maneno. Unajua shida napenda Kiswahili sana. Anasikia upako wa Kiswahili. Almejaa mashindano ya maneno yasiyo na matendo. Hiki kizazi ukiona hiki kizazi kikiongea Munaongea vitu tunafikiria dunia inaisha kesho. Lakini tukuje matendo. Yeah. Angalia jirani mwambie tumekusikia sasa tuoneshe. Yesu akawaambia msipo amini maneno yangu. Amin matendo uwezi kuwa na Yesu ukawa mtu wa maneno matupu utakuwa na maneno na matendo ah. nasema ukiwa na Yesu ah, saidia jirani mhubirie nasema ukiwa na Yesu sio maneno tu sio sio maneno ya Jumapili unakaa kanisa na Jumapili unakaa shetani hapana ukiwa na Yesu maneno yako yanafuatwa na matendo Huyo ni Yesu. Uwezi kuwa na Yesu ukawa mtu wa maneno. Ambayo katika hayo utoka usuda. Sasa angalia matendo, uzao wa hii drama. Uzao wa kuwa na utupu wa Yesu, kuwa na kiburi. Simuseme kwani uko nayo. Si utaje kama una kama una we taja. Uzao wa kuwa na kiburi kuwa na wazimu si utaje kwa sauti kwani unaogopa ni wewe na kama hauna taja zaidi uzao wa kuwa na ma, na majivuno eh ikifuatwa na nini uwazimu mashindano eh kutokuwa na ufahamu wa Yesu na maneno yake inazaa nini usuda Usuda ni envy. Munaenviana, karibu muingiane. Umejaa attitude. Na wewe ni kijana, ukizeeka utakuwa unakaa nyinyi. Nirudie umejaa attitude umejaa kiburi na we ni kijana ukizeeka utakuwa nini bora kaka kama kianzesta kikitu umekunjamana uso ujana ni nguvu na ukiwa na Yesu ni furaha hey shagadaba kula basata Hallelujah sambate I say hallelujah Nitahubiri hata msiposema amen Yes Mimi sijajiriwa na mwanadamu niliitwa Kori basaka taba Heketelo pa Subelege shagalala Hey kama una wasiwasi unapiga kelele kama mimi kama Yesu yuko ndani unasema hey Hallelujah I love Jesus and I have no apology Ma uzao wa hiyo vituko ni envy 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 Nilielezwa kitu nikaona aibu sana na hiki kizazi. 
nilielezwa kitu nikashtuka sana kitu kinazaliwa na iki kizazi kukosa Yesu kijana mmoja ameposa msichana mwambie jirani eh amepoza msichana na kijana mwingine hapa shida ile kona hiki za mpaka vijana wako na envy <laughs> yani usuda <laughs> hata hiyo neno haina neema <laughs> usuda angalia <laughs> jirani mwambie usuda <laughs> kitu ya shetani kitu mbaya sasa ameposa msichana kijana mwingine akaingiwa na usuda nv kaenda akamwambia aka anataka huyo msichana akaambia huyo kijana huyo msichana ni hatari sana wao piga watu ngeta huyo msichana kwao wanafundishwa kupiga watu ngeta <coughs> usuda hiyo ni mazao ya usuda na kijana tu huyo tu wa kueleza hiyo ma story akaenda kwa msichana akamwambia huyo kijana ni ni hako na shida unaona hapa kwa mgongo hako na kitu iko hapo kubwa ndio unaona anga saa nyingine anafanya nini kitu iko hapo mbaya sana utawapa mtu aina hiyo <laughs> usuda wao wakakosa kusikiza tu wakaenda wa wale katika ile mipango ya kuoana kupanga kuoana kijana siku moja akafanya hivi <laughs> ile unajua shetani ni programa <laughs> kijana kufanya hivi msichana akashtuka akasema ndio hiyo ndio hii ile kitu niliambiwa akamwambia msichana msichana akaambia kijana alipoona akifanya mkono akamwambia wacha 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 nikusaidie wacha nikuangalie ni nini hiyo naye kijana akakumbuka aliambiwa hawa watu kajua ile ngeta <laughs> na usiano wa mtu mzuri na kijana mzuri ukakufia hapo ule sasa walipoachana akachukua msichana akawa isipokuwa ukiwa na upako wa shetani kina kwa hivyo <laughs> usuda <laughs> hivi tu msichana akamwambia hey, wacha 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 nikusaidie ndio a confirm naye msichana sasa ile anamwambia wacha nikusaidie akikaribia hapa analeta mkono kijana kajua ndio hiyo tena leo ningeta <laughs> sitakufa Jambo la pili ni nini? Ugomvi. Vita. Envy. Naona vitu kwa runinga. Mtu anakata mwingine kwa upanga. Watu wamesoma shule. Ni shule iliwasoma. Jamani wao walisoma shule. Ama ni dawati ilikuwa inasoma. The dramas, the things you are hearing with this generation are saddening. Sudden. Sudden ugomvi, hatred, bitterness. So bitter, so thin, the spirit of offense.
Number three, uzao wa kukosa Yesu na mafundisho yake. Ni nini? Matusi. Matusi. Zile lugha hiki kizazi kinapitanishana matusi baya matusi na shida ni kwamba una practice hiyo kitu mpaka unaingia kwa ndoa na hiyo tabia ndio unaona tabia ndio unaona ndoa za kizazi hiki ziko na changamoto kwa sababu umeingia kwa ndoa na tabia zingine zisizo reflect Christ Luga chafu Eshima hakuna Unyenyekevu hakuna Niache hapo ama tuendelee Number 3 Number 3 ama ni 4 4 Na shuku mbaya Suspicion mpaka mtu akikubariki unamsuspect ah alikutumia pesa ngapi 1500 ni sacrifice amekutoa illuminati even when somebody is doing you good and do you know what is the reason because you don't have christ to know that while you are in christ no weapon formed against you thing with thanksgiving whether in devil worship or whatever you give it to me i pray for it it changes lakini kwa sababu muna utupu utupu wa neno la mungu utupu wa kristo mwenyewe shuku mbaya mstari wa 5 unasema nini tumalizia na kuzozana miongoni mwa watu walio potoka katika akili zao mnaongeleshana na capital letter hey tete maji kuya nenda hey unashindwa ni kikosi kinaendelea kutrainiwa mnaongea kama vikosi angalia jirani mwamuli wewe ni kikosi umekuwa Can you speak in small letters? Kuya. Hey. Jo. Mshindwa ni ni mifugo inafugwa. Ama ni watu. huku wakidhiaki wakidhani ya kuwa utaua ni njia ya kupata faida you've been put a mentality of extortion an extortion mentality you get into a relationship i like it the way reverend titus put it the other day where you are young You want a young man who is driving 4x4 four four and who has a six figure salary. If you yourself you don't have it, where did he get it from? It does not begin that way. The Bible says do not despise small beginnings. Kama ana gari wewe utli kama we una alitoa wapi Ukibarikiwa na mmoja ako nayo haleluya lakini sio sio poem sio kibwagizo atahitajirudianga kwa kila mtu Angalia jirani mwambie sio kibwagizo <laughs> I want an I want I want a TBH. I'm on a luga chaf. I want pastor I want to get married to a TBH. Mpaka unanishtua kwa desk na kuuliza come again what did you mean? 
pastor, I want to be married by a TBH. Na shindwa ni Rory, I'm a transistor. Hii ni scan ya inatajwa hapa. Ama ni Mercedes. First I want to marry. Get married by a TBH. Na kuli. Na baka na chukua kalamu ni andike hapo. T. B. H. <laughs> Tall. B. Oh it is TDH. Oh sorry. Unasikia ili ni confused. Wakati ni liambewa. TDH. Tall dark and handsome. Unaangalia ule anasema hivyo? <laughs> Unaongea na tanks. Unasema shala bakata. Anafikiria ni kushukurani. Anafikiria ni shukurani. <laughs> Tuache hapo ama tuendelee. <laughs> At the pastor. You know me, I'm shocked. I'm there, some. Now, I'm going to kill a can of fungua fungua. Pastor, I want to get married to a TBH. Oh, TDH. Come on, is a what? Is that a transit? Or is that it's a flat somewhere in Nairobi? Come on, is a yes, sister. What did you mean? Pastor. TDH. Nikauliza, eh? Kachukua kalamu. T, D, H. Nikauliza, come again, sister. Kaniambia, to. Nikamua, karibu ni chukue tepumesha. Some of these things only exist between your two years. They are not in the real life. Ate wa wow. Muko na kazi. Ii shida muko nayo itasuluishwa na kuingiza yesu kwa moyo. Ndi anaeza kukunomo. Mutu uyo akuyuko nomo. Nae hapa kuna ndugu ameamini. Ameamini. Amefunga. Ameompa. Anaongea na tanks. Akiomba anaomba unashindwa. Kumbe ni demonstration. Anajaribu kumove dada. Ajue hapa kwa priest. Is on a diet, did it? Nandu go up a shalaba. Do go up a medi torture. How could say, Leva, so, Susan, 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 Nadada could did What is this? Pacam on a confused atmosphere, Ganisa. Kesha muzima inaisha. <laughs> Na mambo mawili. Hapa iko. Shish. Huyu ni ti, ti, ti. Unaisha. <laughs> Usiku muzima. With unrealisticness. Hebu <laughs> inuwa njirani mufanye. <laughs> Mambe bi nomo. <laughs> Na ni Yesu peke yake. Yesu. Angalia jirani muambie. Ni Yesu peke yake. Hata kunomalize. Sio TDH. Yesu. Yesu peke yake. Kuelewa utawa. Yani. Naeza kuwa sina hela. Naeza kuwa sina cheo, lakini nimeteuliwa. Wapendwa, dada nisikize, wachana na mambo ya magari na pesa. Na ikawa hizo vitu ni muzuri. Kwanza tafuta ndani ya ndugu roo ya uteua. 
mtu alie muteuliwa hawezi akakutusi hawezi akakuchapa kofi nikae hapo kidogo nasema muteule angalia jirani mwambie muteule tdh itabadilika ikuwe transist na itakukanyanga lakini muteule itakuwa scania usiku wa manane ingurumia hapo kwa nyumba hang na iongezwe pepo ngea na shetani ipige u turn ushindo what is this uanze kunipigia usiku basta basta na mimi na sasa hizo ni shagalagala na kwambia ungetafuta uteua ungetafuta uteua sio kucha wadugu sio kucha hiyo kucha inaweza ikakurarua kama ya mwewe tafuta uteua tumefanya counseling wakao wamerarolewa uso nafikiria ndo kama alikuwa anashika kuku usiku verse number 11 kwa Kiswahili anasema bali wewe makaya laba bali wewe ulie kanisani bali wewe ulie mjua kristo mtu wa Mungu angalia goo jirani gonga hivi mwambie bali wewe bali wewe uyakimbie mambo hayo on somebody put your hands together and say bali wewe bali wewe uyakimbie mambo hayo uyakimbie sio uyaache ponyoka toweka uyakimbie yes yeah ufuate mazule ufuate haki oh ufuate nini haki kunaweza kuwa hakuna gari kunaweza kuwa hakuna kazi kubwa anaweza kuwa ana cheo anaweza kuwa ana forex ya miraba msita lakini ana haki nasema kuna haki ukiwa na haki hautadhulumiwa hey! somebody celebrate jesus i say celebrate jesus i say celebrate jesus Hallelujah I say hallelujah Nimehesabiwa haki Na nimehesabiwa Nimefanyika kuwa mwana Nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika kuwa mwana Nimehesabiwa haki Nimehema ya mkombozi Nimehema siku sahi Nimehema ya mkombozi Nimehema siku sahi Nimefanyika kuwa mwana nimehesabiwa kama mpushe nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki nimefanyika nimefanyika kuwa mwana nimehesabiwa haki nimehesabiwa haki nimefanyika nimefanyika kuwa angalia jirani mwambie jamani nimehesabiwa nime nime Si 
Wanapigana vibao. Puh, pita. Lakini kwa yesu. Ukiona mwanaume. Alie ndani ya yesu. Ajui kudhulumu wanawake. Anawabeba na haki. Anaelewa kuna mandiko. Anasema na wake ni viumbe dhaifu. Kukoli maseke. Kukoli ya mazeka. Una mshika mkolo na mwambia sweetheart. Hata kama umechelewa 22. Oh God. Anasema pigana vita vile vizuri. Sio zile za ugombi. Sio zile za ile neno imesema ile ile nini? Sio za usuda. Sio za usuda. 
ni vya vita vizuri vya imani na tena unashika shika sana ulicho nacho ufunuo tatu kumi na shika sana anarudiwa pale shika uzima ule wa milele ulioitiwa ukaongama he maongamo mazuri kijana aliye na haya mambo hata ukiangalia kiungamo chake kama nimearibu Kiswahili kiungamo hata ukiangalia kiungamo chake hata akiwa amekasirika kiungamo chake kiko na amani kura mashaka inua mikono yako <laughs> inua mikono yako tu mwambie bwana ni wewe tu nitashika uzima mando robo shaka talaba come on somebody pray for yourself nitashika sana lendo robo shaka kulelelele ba mandelelele bosh zaka talela ba Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa na nimehesabiwa Nimefanyika kuwa Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki Nimehesabiwa mfalme Oh <laughs> Ya Mungu mtu wa milki ya Mungu nimefanyika kuwa mwana ni neema ni neema ya Mungu ni neema ni neema siku sahi ni neema se ni neema ya Mungu sema tena ni neema siku sahi Nimefanyika kuwa nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimefanyika na nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika nimefanyika kuwa mwana he na nimehesabiwa haki Nimefanyika kuwa mwana na nimehesabiwa haki Lift up both of your hands to heaven. Rudia haya maombi sema Bwana Yesu na kushukuru jioni ya leo kwa neno lako na kushukuru kwa kunielekeza kupitia Timotheo 6:11. Sema Timotheo 6:11. Zela magadaba inasema nini? Inasema shika Uyakimbie, sema nitayakimbia Mambo yote Ya sio ya imani Ya sio ya utewa Ya sio na haki Ya sio jenga imani Ya sio ya upendo Ya sio na subira Ya sio na upole Nitayakimbia Na jiondoa Na mambo ya usuda Na jiondoa na mambo ya ugomvi na mjiondoa kwa mambo ya kizazi changu ya sio tukuza Mungu siku ya leo na utoa mwili wangu na itoa nafsi yangu 
Kama la piu Ilio hai Ilio hai Tenda na mibwana Vile upendavyo Nika kuishie Kwa ujana wangu Nika kutumikie Kwa nguvu zangu Na siku zangu Za ujanani Kwa jina la Yesu Christo If you pray that prayer after me and you're there and you're saying pastor before you close I want to give my life to Jesus this is a special moment that you can open your heart to the Lord and receive salvation and receive transformation so if you're saying please man of God pray with me it will be my joy if you can repeat this prayer please pray after me say Lord Jesus tonight I thank you for your word I receive it I believe in my heart that Jesus Christ is the son of God and that God raised Jesus from the dead from today my sins are forgiven I am a new creation I am born again I'm a child of God I'll live for God and honor God all the days of my life if you pray that prayer after me allow me to pray for you may the power of the Holy Ghost come upon you right now even everybody in the house lift up your hands I pray may the spirit of God come upon you right now I cast out every infirmity I rebuke every attack in your spirit I break every bondage in the mighty name of Jesus may the spirit of God rest upon you may the impartation of the grace of God that teaches us to say no to all ungodliness rest upon you May the Lord change you. May the Lord deliver you. May the Lord save you. May the Lord shift you and usher you to another dimension. Receive the grace of God. Receive the power of God. Receive the anointing of the Holy Ghost. You will never be the same again. I declare a lifting in your spirit. I declare an impartation over your life. And if you are sick in your body, I cast away that infirmity. I uproot that in disease out of you. You are blessed. Your body is the temple of the spirit of God. I declare the power, the anointing, the grace of God over your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Tonight we worship you. Just lift up your hands and bless his name. We give you glory. Thank you for your word. Thank you for speaking to us. Thank you for your presence. Your sweet presence. The sweet presence of the Holy Ghost. We are so grateful. We give you glory, Lord. As we honor you. We give you glory, Lord. As we honor you. You.
Tell him from the bottom of your heart. service by sacrificing and worshiping the Lord with our substances and so we want to welcome you to be part of what the Lord is doing in this house if you go to the screens you will find our M-Pesa number you go to the pay bill our business number is 247 247 our account number is 555 and as you give your sacrifice, as you give your offering, I pray that may the Lord bless you. May the Lord prosper you. May the Lord establish you. May the Lord raise you to higher heights and dimensions. You are blessed. You are favored. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray and we believe. Amen and amen. Put your hands together and appreciate the Lord. Thank you for watching. Thank you for partnering with us. Thank you for sending your love, gift, your support. We love you so much. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you so much. Thank you for being there. We love you. We treasure you.